Okay, so here we go again. So we file new, just a blank document, and then we come across the mailings, check on the envelopes, click on the envelopes button, then we make sure our return address is right. Then went over to options to make sure we've got the right envelope size and then the printing options to make sure that the envelope fits into your printer the right way and you'll have to trial that on your actual printer to work out that, how that goes then we wanted to select recipients and we use the existing list which was spreadsheets and it was new, new child care centers or picking on vacation care then this is different to what we did last time so we did um, start mail merge select envelopes hit OK and that then changes the layout yeah. then we can click into the, uh, the center here which is then we're going to click on the address block then from the address block we want to actually match the fields and make sure that um, what's on your spreadsheet matches with words so instead of being last name of a person we don't have any people names but we have company name so get that one right and then everything else here was wasn't matched so that's okay you can have a look at a couple to preview it that looks good and the next thing we want to do was preview the results and this is where we had the we can make the decision about is that too big or too small and is is that in the right spot so if we want to make it bigger we can just highlight it then go back up to the home home tab and I just grow the front have you want it yeah at that size yeah um, seeing how this is wrapping I would click on the uh, the border here and I would drag out the yep. the box yeah and then I might position it you know, a bit more centered or something like that yeah wherever you want to put put it in the envelope so that that then looks good back to mailings and then um, click on the last record button to make sure that you've got the right number of records so we've got 96 not 6900 or something you know where all those zeros were, were there so check your number of number of recipients and then uh, the last step is finish and merge printed documents going to your to your printer and you can so do that finish and merge you say yeah and we could probably print one of these for a uh, for a test black paper but so then how do you go to put the next one when you when you hit finish and merge yeah. hit printed documents you could select all oh, okay. and it would print the 96 yeah yeah but we won't do that <coughs>